What if I don't feel like talking? Should I come to therapy anyway? Okay, if the therapy is really addressing significant issues, there are going to be times when instead of being eager to talk, you're going to feel like clamming up. This is to be expected. It's part of the structure of a regular time and regular sessions are well, in fact, therapeutic. Emotional pain brings us into therapy, and any subject which causes us pain also has a component of resistance. That is that feeling of, I don't want to talk about it, of not having anything to say. We repress, bury, forget painful stuff. It still has an effect on us, but it is out of our awareness. Many times, life experience forces it into awareness. The yucky stuff comes to the surface, and that's what gets us into therapy. As we start to feel better and get away from the yucky stuff, we don't want to bring it up. However, this is the time when it can be the most useful to talk, because chances are that yucky stuff is having way more an effect on your life than you're aware of. So yes, apply some discipline here, go to your appointment, even if and especially if you don't feel like talking. Dig deep, pull up the yucky feelings, air them out, and this is where you can really lean into the full experience of all that therapy can offer. You could just break through some blocks that have been weighing you down in ways you're unaware of until now. When you can understand this and air it out, it is the real golden therapy that you won't find anywhere else.